Yo, what's up boys, and welcome back to another Shitty Survival Sundays. I realized recently it's Sunday, and by recently I mean in the past hour, and also I haven't actually made a video in the series, the Shitty Survival Sunday series, in a while, so why not go ahead and try out a game. This game came out three weeks ago, it's called Zombies on a Plane, it's got about 30 reviews, it's got their $4 DLC to play as Santa, if you want, as you can see right here. Um, I mean, you can't actually see Santa, you have to like buy him to see him. All the characters look like they are made out of Play-Doh, and this game has two different game modes. It's got a survival game mode in which you'll be shooting, hence the name Shitty Survival Sundays. What would it be without the zombies and the surviving? And then there's also a flying game mode where you control a plane and attempt to throw zombies off of your plane. I've already played the shooting game mode and do you know what? It's actually really shit um, from a few minutes I've played it and I don't really want to play it that much. So we're going to play that later on. First we're going to start off and see what happens on Flight of Survival trying to um, push zombies off of our planes. Let's see, fight to keep the plane in the air for as long as you can, blah blah blah, WSD. Uh, you can get like Call of Duty boost or some shit. Um, and that's that's pretty much it, let's let's try it out. So we've got a few different aircrafts we can try. We've got a private jet for um, the richer viewers out there, and then also a jumbo jet. I think we're gonna go with the, uh, what does that say? I can't even read it, whatever, let's just go and fly it and see what happens. So WSD, control, camera, QE, zoom camera. As a whole, do you know what, when I seen someone linked with this, zombies on a plane. Zombies incoming. Okay. When I heard that, what the fuck, the controls are invert. Okay, this is like really AIDS. When I heard that, I can't play this. I need to fix this. When I heard the idea of zombies on a plane, you know, defending uh, a, a moving plane in the air. Why the fuck? Oh, it's controller. Controls, okay. Um, when I heard the idea of that, there's, there's no way to change this, okay. It sounded really cool and I wanted to play it, but then I realized very quickly it's got very bad reviews and I wasn't really sure why. So that's what we're going to be working out today. We're going to be working out why does this game have bad reviews. Honestly, I can't control it when when the fucking controls are inverted. I don't know what even to do. The zombies are literally walking on my plane while upside down. I'm going to crash the plane. If I can't do good in this game mode, that means the uh, mass portion of the video is going to be on the fucking shooting portion of the game. And I really don't like that. And I can't control it. My plane's exploding. How are you supposed to survive 10 waves? This is easy. I literally can't see shit. Hold space. Okay, let's go first person. Like, how do I repair? I mean, I, I don't understand. Yes! Okay, I think that's a bit better. So I've changed the camera view now so I can actually see what's going on. But how am I supposed oh. to do anything? Like, zombies just don't fall off. I feel like I'm missing the point of this game mode. But like someone said in the review, in fact everyone said in the review, it's a great idea, it's shitly executed. Yes. See, we're attacking my cockpit now. Watch all the planes coming your way. Alright, let's change the view. What planes? There's boats. I mean, it looks pretty. Oh, yeah. I got an achievement. Um, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing right now, guys, honestly. I just feel like people are going to get angry at me because I've... I mean, role playing up and down... Uh, accelerate up, down. What do you mean up and down? What the fuck's up and down? Like my arrow keys? Alright. That's not working. Why is it snowing now? I just smashed into a plane. What do you mean difficulty level 5? My plane literally, it's like, it's a bit fucked. I, I don't... Okay, we're not playing that game mode anymore. Oh. Yeah, we're not playing that game mode anymore. I don't like that game mode. Okay, that was really enjoyable. Let's see. Hone your flight skills. So you can, I guess you can do it as long as you want. What makes this easy? What makes this hard? I don't know. But I mean, move such activate part of the zombie. Okay, cool. Activate the part of the plane. What do you mean activated? Look in the key bearings window to view controls. Okay, cool. Well, that game mode sucks dick. Let's just try surviving against a horde in a plane. I want to show you guys some screenshots already. And you should be able to tell. But this is... This is all survival inside the plane, and can you play it with friends? Uh, no, you can't. This is a single player game, just to answer your question. And you need to literally sit inside a plane and play as Santa if you want to give him $4 extra. And um, just make sure the zombies don't do anything bad. So you get Call of Duty unlocks on the floor for like ammo replenishment, and you get money and stuff. And it's weird, this is actually. I played cockpit before, but it's exactly the same as cockpit. I don't understand what made cockpit cockpit, because we weren't in a cockpit, but. We're now just in the plane as a whole, so that's cool. So you can see there's a Call of Duty shit right there. So this is Call of Duty Zombies, which, as you guys should know, if you're a big fan of Assassin's Creed Enterprises, I fucking hate Call of Duty Zombies. I don't understand why people find it fun. It's literally just shooting zombie after zombie and fucking going in circles, right? So you need to defend the doors. The zombies will start attacking the doors. 
I think at least. I mean, they can't attack with doors, right? They didn't other game, but wow. even if we do that, it should. Um, there we go. Got all my all my pistol now. They should. Oh, you can hold left click with this pistol. Shit. They should um, allow all the zombies to come inside, and you can also battle on top of the plane. Yes. Looking at the images, but I've never done. What the? F that was a trap. Okay. We have never managed to get actually on top of the plane. I don't know how to do that. Maybe we need to like go a certain way or something. Oh, I guess we'll try the other game modes. But yeah, pretty much you just hold left click. And zombies come towards you in this game mode, it looks like. Like, literally. What else is there to it? Um, I mean, my screen's like blurring right now. This game looks super realistic right now. Okay, we've got a shotgun. Cool. I mean, it's not that bad. It just kind of makes me want to kill myself, to be honest. We've got a speed boost. We're going to become Sonic the Hedgehog now. Okay. I'm reloading it by fucking fingering it. Awesome. I, I don't think this game deserves as much flack as it gets for. Like, it's a cool idea and it's not that bad. Like, it's it's okay. It's made by a UK development studio. It's on uh, Unreal. It runs pretty decent. It looks pretty decent. I, I have played some really shitty fucking unturned copy pastes uh, recently. Which is, I don't know. It's kind of the reason I stopped making Shitty Sour Sunday's videos is because we're just ending up being the same thing every single time. Just really, really badly made games. This game's kind of a cool idea. Yes. I can shoot up limbs. It's kind of okay. Like, look at that. I just oh, shot up a dude's limb. Yeah. My character just went, oh yeah. Uh, we've got an assault rifle now. Difficulty level 5. Okay, cool. So you can see the doors are now busted open and we can actually um, swoop you out if you do get close to them. So I need to make sure not to get too close. The zombie's running. It looks pretty cute to be honest. Not gonna lie. What the fuck are you doing? Fuck off. Uh, well, I'll show you. I'll let them get up close. Where you at? There you go. So that's a zombie crawling animation right there. You can see, it looks very cute. You just want to bring one of them home. And name it, I don't know, a dog name. Because it kind of looks like a dog. With special needs. And I'm slowly but surely getting pushed back. I don't really like this. Let's right, just push forward. Alright, there's not really much else to it. I mean, unless I can work out a way to get on top of a plane. Like, that's fucking dope, but I can't really work it out, so... I mean, you just hold left click and look straight, so... I feel like I'm being really critical, but then I'm also saying it's really good. I'm not sure what, what, what I'm trying to convey right now, because I'm not saying it's bad, yes. I'm not saying it's good. I'm just saying it's a game. I mean, that's all this is. It's just a game. Um, let's see, what can we do here? Wow. So we can't open up this door, can we? No. It said all parts repaired as well. I think we just, like, picked up a power-up to, like, repair everything or some shit. I don't know. I don't know, I'm not sure if the, the sound effects choice is definitely questionable. Probably one of the most questionable parts of the game. Along with why the fuck we decided not to make it uh, inverted for the plane. Or, I don't know which which way it was, but it was kind of stressing me out. I used to play in, uh, inverted on a Call of Duty uh, Xbox controller, you know, because I'm a big, big no scope fan. So, going from that to flying a plane yes! not inverted or inverted, it, it didn't go right. And another reason I stopped making shit sales on these yes. games. Or videos even is because it just ended up uh, being literally me talking about how much the game sucks or doesn't suck for 10 minutes, and that's exactly what's happening with this video. There's nothing bad about the game. It's a shit. I mean, it's not shit. It's just I don't know what it is. But, you know, if you guys want to be interested in some more, you know, I'd I'd love to do some more of it. There's, there's a decent amount of games I could play, but I mean, how how could this possibly be fun to watch? I was actually gonna like literally not even record it, but then I thought, okay, I'll just do it anyway because I've recorded a few days. But I mean, this is turning out pretty boring. Like, where's my HP right now? My HP is, I, I don't know where. It's nowhere. Oh, I'm reloading. I'm reloading my chainsaw. What am I getting hit by? I think I'm almost dead. So I'm gonna get my all-time high score right here. See, I thought it was going to be like Kiln Floor where you do waves and then you buy stuff or some shit. And that would be kind of cool if it was multiplayer, but it isn't multiplayer. And the waves just come after, you know, wave after wave after wave. I don't even know what I'm actually defending right now. This is fuck. Oh, it's a survival, actually. This is a survival game mode. Honestly, fuck this. This sucks. Oh, it doesn't suck. But I'm going to go play the game mode where you have to defend certain parts of the, the aircraft instead. So you can see if I get here, I can't. I literally can't move backwards too quickly. So if I press space, I'm like, wee! And then I'm dead and I just flew through a fucking thing. Alright, well, that sucked.
So that was really fun. That was five minutes right there. Let's try defend defend outside. Let's go outside the plane. Okay, this is how you go outside the plane. Right? Maybe this will be okay. So we can't play Santa still. Let's play as Jackson because he's a big black man. He's an FBI agent, obviously. Um, something about snakes on a plane. Nice meme. Uh, game developers right there. Fucking geniuses. Let's see how it is defending from a top of a plane. Also, you can play third person, in case you were wondering. But past that, there isn't really much else to it. Uh, I'm not sure if it's a posh portion of a plane I need to defend or anything. And I don't know. Uh, can I go down here? Is this okay? I mean, should I do this? Like, what are the zombies going for? Okay. Oh, they're hitting things, or maybe I'm hitting things. That dude's got a briefcase, not sure where he's going. Mm. Alright, now I've got an all my pistol. Like, literally, you just fucking grind until you've got dank ass weapons, and then it just becomes super easy. I mean, I feel like I'm blind, and I should be able to work out where my health is, but I, I literally just can't see it. So I'm assuming you've got, like, regen and Call of Duty HP, since this is just Call of Duty Zombies, but I don't see it. Uh, I guess I can repair this. Oh, stop it. Stop it. I don't know how you got up here, so we can hold F to repair. So we're 20 seconds to repair pass now. So this game mode and the other one as well. Can I actually jump up here? What the fuck? Alright, I just flew. Um, this game mode and the other one, you have to repair and protect the wings. So you can see I can repair this wing. And then eventually, obviously, we're going to fuck the wing. I don't know how I'm literally flying right now, by the way. Like, I mean, I've now been on top of a plane where it's propelled... Or propelled in the air, but I don't think this is how uh, physics work. But I mean, it's kind of cool. I mean, look at that. That zombie's literally walking sideways right now. Did you guys see that? Ooh. See, this game wants more what I'm talking about, man. This really um, brings the shitty style Sundays to shitty style Sundays, you know? Of a shitty. Not of a shitty style Sundays to shitty style Sundays. That doesn't make any sense. I mean, I did see a few zombies walking upside down on a plane earlier, but I didn't think that was going to happen in this game as well. But it does definitely immerse me in the zombie survival. Um, oh, wow. I just one-shot yes. that nerd. Zombie survival scenario, so. I got one place we'll trap, cool. Stop it. Thank you. So I repaired again. Yeah, I don't know, man. If, we, if it was multiplayer, I think this game would be actually decent. $20, maybe not. It is a bit of a scam, and I am definitely going to get a refund for this game. Because it does kind of get boring. But it's okay. It's a cool idea. You can play as Santa. What, what the fuck? Okay. That's a zombie walking on the side of a plane again. How you doing? I mean, is that like a feature or like, I don't know. Maybe it's just like this. I mean, it's got to be a feature. I mean, literally all the zombies are walking on the side of the plane right now. Like, how how did the developers say, oh yeah, mm. one zombie's come out of this fucking door and they're going to walk sideways? How does that make any sense? Like, it just looks stupid. How is he crawling on literally thin air? Yes! Oh, he has thicker up here. So it's not literally thin air. Alright, I'm going to be back in like 10 waves. This is... Oh. This is bad. Get off. Check for cockpit. Oh shit, I said 10 waves, I lied. I'm now at the cockpit, so I need to, I need to record this so I can show you guys the, the dynamic video game we've got right here. So we need to defend the cockpit, make sure we don't get in. The pilots are actually having a really good time right now, you can see. I, I don't understand. I mean, are you guys planning on landing somewhere? Like, I mean, look like landing in the water and probably add swim with zombies. I mean, can zombies even swim? And also, it turns out, you less, yes, when you jump, you can go like 10 meters in there. I, I didn't realize. I thought I was like someone sliding up it, but oh shit, that zombie just spawned on me or something. I don't know. But no, it's just how the game is. For, uh, okay, we've got every single yes! weapon in the game now, except for chainsaw. Fuck you. We've got 10 seconds or 20 seconds to repair. Like, how is this even hard? What the fuck even is that? Oh. Wow, that's amazing. It's like tower defense, but with zombies and shit. Uh, honestly, I'm done with this game. I, I don't know why I even made a video. I, I, I don't know. If you guys want to see some more Shoot Cell Sundays, then leave a like and a comment or whatever. And I'll definitely make some more. I just killed a dog. Sorry, dog fans. I'm a dog fan. Um, yes. But yeah, thanks a lot for watching, guys. If you like Call of Duty and you want to play on a plane, this is a game for you. This may as well be fucking Call of Duty DLC or Call of Duty Zombies DLC. And that'll, that'll be, it's, it's not a bad idea, you know. If I haven't done it, I don't, I don't think. Not that I've ever played the games. Um, but it isn't DLC. It's actually a $20 game with $4 Santa DLC, so it's a bit different. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to comment, and subscribe, and more good stuff. I would give this game a 10 out of 10. Definitely check it out. Steam link in the description below. Shout out to the devs, Shang, whatever the fuck they're called. You suck dick. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for the refund, devs. Your game sucks. Sorry. I mean, it doesn't suck. It's just... No, it sucks. Fuck you.